to to school too. Hello. <clears throat> it is raining all over me. I can feel it. That's so good. Tu m'as donné ça. And then I can also, if I can, um, I can um, choose Vajra, choose Vajra background. Where's, where's my Vajra? Wow. Hmm. Thank mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. 
There shall be seasons to fresh air. Mm -hmm. There should be seasons refreshing, sent from the Savior above. Showers of blessing, showers of blessings we need. Keep us from the suffering, for for the showers we need. For the showers we flee, Show, showers of blessing. If trust and obey, the showers fresh. If we let God have His way, showers, showers of blessings, showers of blessings we need. Mercy drops round us are falling, but for the showers we plead. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of Jesus. I want to welcome us once again. I want to welcome us once again to the second day of, I'm trying to do something here. The second day of abundance of showers, God will grant us abundance of showers in the mighty name of Jesus, two, three, six, nine. I'm trying to log on to Facebook so that they can see 
they can also join us and see us. When you do so much at the same time, praise the Lord. I guess this is it. We try and see. <coughs> praise the Lord. Ah. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. All right. Praise God. Okay. I pray that, can you all see me? And can you hear me? Praise the Lord. Hello. Hmm. Okay. All right. Okay. Praise the Lord. Thank you. I was trying to set up um, a live stream on Facebook. So um, hopefully they'll be able to join us as well and we'll be able to see them. So today I welcome us. Second day. I pray that the God who is faithful in all his ways, who has promised to shower us with the former rain, the latter rain, the spring rain, the winter rain, and the, and the fall rain, all in the same month, he will surely bring his word to pass. Praise the name of the Lord. Can we pray? Father, in the name of Jesus, we, your children, we have come again because you are faithful. In all that you promise, you bring it to pass. All glory, honor, dominion, majesty be unto your name. Thank you once again, oh Lord. This is the first Sunday in the year 2021. How awesome, how wonderful you are, Lord. We've already spent three days. Today is the third day. All glory be to your name. Father, as we go into your word and prayers, you've asked us to do it. Daddy, when you ask us to do something and we obey, surely, surely you bring it to pass. You will do your bit, Lord. So therefore, as we go into your word, let the words of my mouth and the meditation of our hearts that be acceptable unto your sight. Holy Spirit, we invite you. You are our partner in prayers. You are the spirit of intercession. As we pray, as we pray, package our prayer. Package our words and let it come up to you as a sweet smelling savour. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. Amen. Our anchor scripture, as the Lord has given us, is Joel 2. Praise the Lord. Joel 2, where the Lord promised us of, of this abundance. The Lord's word, when we get a word from the Lord, is the word of life. Jesus is the living word, and it's also the living waters. So when he gives us a word and we run with it, that shower will come down. So it's not our word. We are not pulling it out of our head. It is the Lord who has given us. Joel 2.23, we continue with still with that verse because it's loaded. It says, be glad ye children of Zion and rejoice in the Lord your God. For he has given you the former rain moderately. He has given you the former rain moderately. There we shall stop for my se segment. He has given us former rain moderately. What does that mean? Every patch ground in a farmer's life in a farmer's field or for the next year's um, uh, uh, seeding, it's usually dry. So the law gives us, gives them that rain moderately so that the ground can be soft, so that there will be no flood, so that the top soil will not be eroded. How does that, that apply to us? 
this morning we are going to pray to the Lord. The Lord will not give you or give me more things that we can handle. He will not give us something that will frustrate us. He will not give us something that will that will um that will um uh, uh, overwhelm us. So this morning we want to first of all thank God, Daddy. I'm grateful that I'm part of the first Sunday of the year 2021. A lot of uh, of us who are on the line now. We are probably not, um, most of us who have already um, finished service, a lot of us in the United States, we are just finishing or just about to. So I want us to thank God. He said, be glad and rejoice. If the Lord has kept you for the first three days, first day, God the Father, God the Son, this is the power of the Holy Spirit. The third day is the day of the Holy Spirit. Let's thank God. Let's thank God. Let's thank God and say, Lord, I'm grateful. I'm grateful that I'm part of the first Sunday. And like I said, please, you can unmute your phone anytime we are praying. Then we, we you can, then you mute it. When we are not praying, we are praying. This is a prayer conference. This is a prayer meeting. So let us, let us thank God. Father, I'm great. Father, I'm great. Father, I'm great. That you have kept me alive. And all my dog wants to say the first three days of this month. Father, I am grateful. Father, I give you glory. I give you worship. I give you congratulations. You are so kind. You are so kind. Thank you for granting me what to be alive. Thank you for preserving my story, my family, my good in the month of January 2021. Father, I worship you. I appreciate you. I appreciate what you are doing. Glory. Thank you for your loving kindness. Thank you for your faithfulness. Thank you for this day of the Trinity. I believe that God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit, we take absolute charge in the name of Jesus. And for those who were not part of us yesterday, we discussed what rain does to the farmer all through the years. When he's uh, uh, preparing the ground, there's always a, 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 a phase that are process to the farmer. The time of seeding or preparing the ground, he doesn't seed at the same time as when he's preparing. The time of preparation, the time of seeding, the time of harvest. Father says, I will give you all that. And to us Christians, that is enablement. To us Christians, that's God sending helpers of destiny to us. To us Christians, that is anointing. To us Christians, is revelation of the word. We need the word. I love prophecy, praise the Lord. By the grace of God, he's giving me that enablement. Bro, prophecy without the word of God. God will speak. It is his word that gives you, that propels you forward to moving and acting in that capacity on that, um, on that prophecy. So that is why this year you need the word, revelation of the word. As you study the word, he gives you a revelation. As he studies the word, he gives you a revelation. He gives you a word. So this morning, we are going to pray, or this afternoon, or this evening, wherever we may be, some are calling in from UK, wherever we may be, we want to pray. Father, the enablement that I need, the help, I don't know what you need. You may need help of destiny, call them for. He says the anointing is giving us, is what we, is our foundation for the year 2021 so that the ground will not be hard, so that the ground will not be hard, so that all that we lay our hands on will not be hard, if we will not labor in the year 2021. We need the enablement of heaven. So I want you to cry to the Lord and say, Father, Father in the in year 2021, that is Lord, uh, I receive the anointing of God. Father, I 
in Deuteronomy 32 verse 2 Deuteronomy 32 verse 2 it also talks about what I've just said about the word of God about the word of God in the book of Deuteronomy 32 verse 2 for those of us who are taking notes you know it talks about the word of God being that see that you and I we need. Hallelujah. Deuteronomy 32 verse 6, verse 2. Deuteronomy 32 verse 2. It says, my doctrine shall drop as the rain. My doctrine, my word shall drop as the rain. My, my speech, my speech, the words that come out of my mouth, shall distill as they do. I will compress them together and I will drop dew upon you as the small rain upon the tender herb and as showers upon the grass. My doctrine, my word, we need to pray. Father, give me an ear to hear and the eyes to see. You know, we do pray one prayer in the redeemed Christian church of God. He goes, Father, did you always say, as the Lord, let me hear the uh, inaudible, what is not being spoken, what is happening in the spirit realm. Give me the air to hear the inaudible and the eyes to see invisible. Father, give me that opportunity, Daddy, anoint me as this rain comes down. Let me see what's happening in the court of heaven. So I know what to do. When you know what to do, when you are ahead of your enemy, life will be easy. Let's pray. I So that when you talk, I can pray only in the mighty name of Jesus. Zachariah 10 1. Zachariah 10 1. See, talking about the rain. Hallelujah. 
Zechariah 10, 1 says, Ask ye of the Lord, hey, in the time of the latter rain, so that the Lord shall make bright clouds. The Lord we make is God that can bless, is God that can enable. He says, and give them showers of rain to everyone grass in the field. Ask of the Lord in the time of the latter rain so that the Lord shall make bright clouds. And within that bright cloud, what do you have there? Within the black cloud, rain is there. Rain that you need, rain that I need. Blessings that I need, blessings that you need. Praise the name of the Lord. Can we please mute our phones? Praise God. Can we mute our phone? Thank you, so that you can hear me very well. They ask you of the Lord, Rain in the time of the latter rain. Other scriptures even tell us that God knows how to give rain in his season. The rain that you need for one project might not be the rain that you need for another project. But Father said all of it, he will grant it, but he will start to manifest it at different times. As you need help out destiny, they will show up. As you need strength, they will show up. As you need healing, it will start to manifest already on you. Because he ask, ask, ask me of rain in the time of the latter rain. And the Lord, across referencing it to Joel 2, uh, 23, he says, I'm going to give you both the latter rain, the former rain, the middle rain in this one month. But it doesn't come, it doesn't manifest, doesn't show. It doesn't become a flood. Because floods, they, they scatter. God will give it to us as we need it. We are going to lift up our voice right now. And we are going to ask the Lord, my Father, my God, I receive, I receive, I receive, I receive. Rain in this season, latter rain, former rain. And Lord, the rain for fall, the rain for autumn, the way rain for winter. Oh Lord, my God, for summer, I receive all for planting, for growth, and for harvesting. My God and my King, I receive all. Father, I receive all. I receive all. In the name of Jesus, cry, cry, cry unto the Lord. And say, Father, I receive this rain, Lord. I receive this rain, Lord. Father, Lord, I know, I know. You say I should ask, and that's why I'm asking. You say whatsoever we ask, we shall receive. My Father, my God, some of us have been to church. We love John again to this prayer conference. My God, I'm asking. I thank you, Lord. I thank you, Lord, because I've asked. You say that you ask, and I'm asking now. I'm asking now. My Father, my God, I thank you, because I'm asking as I'm asking, you are hearing me. Father, you are hearing me. I give you all the glory. I give you all the honor. I give you all the adoration. Blessed be your holy name, O Lord. Blessed be your holy name, O Lord. My God wants us pressed. Unto you, all flesh, we have come this morning. Daddy, thank you. Thank you, my God. Masoto ye kerebo. In Jesus' name. We are praying in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. You know, as I round this session up, before I bring our other minister, do you know that two days ago, I was on my on my bike, my exercise bike, and somehow I was on YouTube. I think I've just finished listening to something, and then you know, he came up. They said the tallest building in um, in where's that the hotel in Dubai and they took us through how it was built the challenges they faced and I'm like why am I watching this after I watched it I was on my bike so I couldn't come down after I watched the father said to me that did I see what those people electrical had challenges when they got to electrical point because the shake now changed some things the foundation had challenges. They've never built such, and they thought they were going to meet rock. As they were going down, it was all sand. They, and they started to think. And they, there was nowhere there that they said they prayed. They said they thought 
the architect, the designer, this and this. And they started putting ideas together. Who gave them the idea? He's not from the devil. Because we all have the spirit of God. Say so he breathed into man and man became a living being. As we finish this segment, I want to tell you that the wisdom God has given you, the knowledge of the almighty God, that will cause you and I to prosper in the year 2021, that will cause our children to prosper, our family to prosper in all that they are doing. They've laid their hands on. God has re re released it unto us these seven days. These seven days, he's released that enablement to us. When the ideas and the thoughts keep coming to you, I want you to know that the inspiration of the Almighty God will make you and I to succeed exceedingly abundantly in the year 2021 in the name of Jesus because the inspiration of the Lord is within us is within us if you if you really want you can go on YouTube on YouTube and search for I, I I don't know the name of the hotel but the tallest hotel in the sea they built it they built it in a man-made in a man-made uh, island go and see I saw challenges they never gave up they fine-tuned their design, they did something, they, uh, they triage, they, 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 you know, work together this year. Please do not give up. Do not give up. The inspiration of the Lord will lead you and guide you in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. I'll yield the control to minister here one day right now. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. And Sikini, uh, good afternoon, Ma. Good afternoon. Thank you so Praise much. God bless you, Ma, for the privilege. It's a privilege. Amen. Thank you so much. The anointing will never run dry. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Good afternoon, everybody. Um, this segment, I want us to focus a lot on how to get this rain. The Lord has already given us the rain. The Bible says that be glad then, you children of Zion and rejoice in the Lord, for he has given you the former rain faithfully, and he will cause the rain to come down for you. So the rain is already, the Lord has rained it. This is a prophetic word. Amen. So the first thing I want us to do is to thank the Lord for the mercy and the love of God, and for he has given us this former rain. I want us to be grateful to God, because the rain was supposed to have rained a year before. Mm. But it did not rain. Mm. But the Lord, in his faithfulness, he remembered. And he came out with, because he knows we need this rain. Mm. The latter rain will not be enough. So I want us to say, Father, Father. in the name of Jesus, thank you so Lord much Jesus. for your love, for your mercy over our lives. You, Lord. For this former for rain that you have laid upon our lives. Father, thank you for your mercy. Thank you for your mercy. We are grateful. We are grateful. We are grateful. We are grateful. Thank you, Jehovah God Almighty. Thank you, my God. We do not even know what we need, Lord. For you know it is the rain that we need. And you have sent it upon us. We are grateful for your love. Thank you. For thank you for your loving kindness. Father, thank you for not leaving us alone. Father, thank you. Thank you. You are such a good God. Such a reliable Father. Thank you. Father, you will not leave us alone or forsake us. Thank you. Thank you. Father, Thank you, my Father. Thank you. Thank you, Lord, for this great love. You are thanking you for the rain of healing. We are thanking you for the rain of life. And rain, especially, is for farmers, mainly for planting and for harvesting and the fruitfulness. So I, the revelation I got again from this is, we have things we have prayed for. We have prayer points that we're still hoping. Those are the, the seed that we have planted. Fasting, praying, praise, worship, mm -hmm. all sorts of things that we have done. Our aspirations for this year, we just want us to remember that because of the rain, because we didn't get that rain, we didn't get that blessing. 
Now God has Amen. given us that rain, and he has promised that he's falling on our heads. Amen. That the Lord Almighty will cause us to harvest in this first Amen. month. Amen. That all the prayer points that we're standing on, we're waiting for the testimonies. Every Amen. prayer, the Lord has, he said, when you call, I answer. He Amen. hears us. Amen. So he's not, he hears us and he sees us. And Amen. he has given us the solution. So Amen. I want us to pray. For our Father, as you have rained on us, as you have rained on, on your promise, Lord. That big Lord. That promise that you have already, it has already rained on us. That and we have rained on rain. us. Thank, thank you for this. We want, want to thank, thank you. 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 Thank you.
My it God. is done. The Lord Amen. has done his own bit. I want us to pray that the almighty God will increase our faith. Amen. Faith to believe. Amen. This session is going to end in a few days' time. But the month of January is not going to end for another 27 days. Mm -hmm. The faith to be able to hold on Hello. that the almighty God will give it to us. Ah, because the Bible says that when we believe the Lord, Second Chronicles 20, 20, he said we shall be established. He said, believe my prophets and you shall prosper. Mm -hmm. This is a word from the throne of God. I'm going to encourage you a bit. In my church this morning, Thanksgiving service, my pastor said he saw crystals dropping from heaven on people's head. He said like rain. He said it was just pouring down. I wanted to start screaming. Because it's the same revelation God gave Pastor Jumi. Rain. It has rained. Hey! So this is so we are going to pray that God increase my faith, oh Lord. I my God, I increase my faith. My Lord, my God, please increase my faith. Jehovah, Lord, increase my faith. Ah, Lord, as I hear from you every day, Lord, increase my faith. Let faith rise up from inside of me. Father, let me exercise this faith. I know you have brought down this rain, and I declare, and I declare that I have received them. Let me my heart. Father, thank you for this. Rain. I believe you. I believe your word. You are not mad that you should die or the son of man that you go back on the world. Have you not said it? Will you not do it? I believe you, my Lord and my God. I believe you that this rain, rain of peace, this rain of joy, this rain of breakthrough, this rain of this rain of favor that, are, that you have poured down upon me this month and upon my family. Ah, I will not travel in the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord God, I thank you. Is our father, we believe you have rained on us already because that's what that pipe, pipe says. Said he rains on, he has rained on us. Mm -hmm. So we stand on that word that you have, you have, it has rained on us already. We trust your word that never returns to you void. Mm -hmm. That it will accomplish that which you said. That today, there shall be a performance to those that believe. That's mm -hmm. what the Bible says. Yes. That today, we shall have a token for good. Caramba. That those at that long awaiting prayer points, those mm -hmm. things we are crying out for you, to you mm -hmm. to do, mm -hmm. those physically, materially, emotionally, spiritually, in every body, soul, and spirit, whatever it is, that today we stand on your word, Lord. Father, Lord Almighty, I say Almighty you Lord. I stand upon your word right now. I stand upon your word and I pray, Almighty God, that there shall be a performance. We believe in you that there shall be a performance. Already you have done it. You have more than the latter rain and the former rain upon, upon your children. Children, upon all those who believe in you, my Lord and my God, please help me to hold on to this word all through this year 2021. Not just this January, but every month of this year 2021. Let your rain continue to pour. Let it continue to pour. The grace to be in this rain. The grace to be in this rain. The grace to be in this rain. The grace to be to encourage us to help us to keep standing and waiting uh, the, the when the the apostles told Jesus to teach them how to pray he gave them the Lord's prayer but well, God gave me a revelation about that a while ago immediately was the parable of the neighbor that came at midnight. And I asked God, how come this came up after the Lord's prayer? The Lord said, that is how to pray. You pray and you stand. Mm. When big children are in, some, a while ago I went to my mom, a child pressed the bell and ran away. Mommy said, don't worry, it's the children on the road, they come, they press the bell and go. We will not be children that press the bell and go. Amen. In that passage, the neighbor stood 
He kept on knocking. Mm. The, 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 the human being was not going to get up, human being. But because of the persistent prayer, he got up, the persistent knocking. And the Bible said, he didn't give him the three loaves he came for. In the Bible said, he gave him all he needed. Mm -hmm. He got up and he continued to say that, how will the Lord not give us what we want? How will the Lord not give us what we want? So my prayer, so um, a prayer from that is that the enablement to stand, mm -hmm. no, to stand in the place of prayer, in the place of fasting, in the place of encounters like this, that the Lord will give us. Because the Lord has said to pray, to know how to pray is persistently. He said the other parable about the, the widow that went to the wicked king. He said that we did not give him what, he, what she wants. So we're going to be persistent. This is the month. He said it falls in the first month. That mm -hmm. is what we're holding on to. Yes. And so the ability to stand, because like I said, this session is going to end. It's not just going to be something we attended. Mm. It's going to, it is starting the year for us. Amen. And so we're going to cry out to God that the almighty God should have mercy upon us. Let his hand be upon us, according to Ezra. That let your hand be upon us to encourage us and to strengthen us. So we can pray and we can stand. That the Lord Almighty will have mercy upon us. So Father, let us pray that Lord, let your good hand be upon us to strengthen us, to encourage us so we can do. We will not knock on you. We will not you are in love for us. We will not knock on you. We will not ask and not receive. We shall seek and not find. We will seek and not find. We will not be warned and not seek. 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 Let my feet stand on the authority of your word. Let my feet stand. Let my feet stand until the very end. Oh, my feet are so fast. As who we are passing away, help me stand to the very end. 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 I will wait on the prayer Amen. Amen. The last one in the precious in that name of teaching of Jesus Amen. on how to pray is that the person got all he needed. I want us to make sure that this session we attach it to important things so that when those testimonies come, we will know that the Lord has answered us. We will not just be those that are just attending Zoom meeting and praying all over the place and not knowing what we're doing it for. But we are going to stand and declare that, as you said, you rained on me. This thing, you have rained on it. This one, you have rained on it. That manifestation starts. That Lord will help us, oh Lord, to be open, to our eyes to be open to what the Lord is doing in our lives right now. The Lord, I think it's the passage about clarity. What you are doing, Holy Spirit, that thing, is it work? Should I go and look for that job now? Should I start looking for that business now? Is it marriage? What is it, oh Lord, that you are doing? That, what did you rain on? Holy yes. Spirit, give me the clarity and the revelation that I may stand I will know that I received in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. We give Father, you the we give you the Father, we you that you we pray, pray for clarity. Open our hearts, open our understanding, open our ears, open our eyes. Father, in heaven, as we present our request before you, Father, in heaven, Father, I pray that you continue to serve and devote to you every end of my life. Thank you, Lord, for your advancing Thank you, Lord, for your advancing Thank you, Lord, that you Thank you, Lord, because we Amen. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Mr. Yewande. God bless you. God bless you really good.
you know, and uh, the closing, the, in five minutes, we shall be closing. And the closing word that the Lord gave me for, um, for this session is, and it's so amazing that the word, the word kept on coming, revelation of the word. We need understanding of the word to receive performance. Mm -hmm. Proverbs 24, verse 14. Proverbs 24, 14 is a verse we know very well. But do you know that we always um, uh, say the latter part all the time? Just we call the one that suits us. Listen to what he reads. He says, so shall the knowledge, watch that word, so shall the knowledge of wisdom be unto thy soul. So shall the knowledge of wisdom be unto thy soul. When thou hast found it, when you have found that knowledge of wisdom, then, 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 I say three times, then there shall be a reward. When you have found the knowledge of wisdom, when you have found the word of God, when you have found the revelation of what you are supposed to run with, praise the name of the Lord. It will not be everywhere that we will go. No, it's not every phone call we will we, we call. It's not every social media we, we should be on. It's not every text we will respond to knowledge of wisdom. He said, when you have found it, then there shall be a reward. It's after you have found the knowledge of wisdom and thy expectation and thy expectation and my expectation shall not be cut short. My <laughs> expectation, your expectation shall be manifested in the name of Jesus. Once we match the, the knowledge of wisdom. So in the next two minutes, I want us to ask the Lord for the rain to catch the knowledge of wisdom. The knowledge of wisdom to be able, the Lord has already given us wisdom from his word, but how to translate that wisdom to knowledge. And knowledge is how we now, um, how we manifest what the Lord wants us. So I want us to pray to the Lord and say, finally, Lord, even for this second day of your battery, that the Lord enablement to decipher your word, the enablement to decipher your word, knowledge of wisdom, knowledge of, say, when I receive it, when I receive it, then my expectation shall not be cultured. Then there shall be performance. Then there shall be performance. My Father, my God, thank Thank you, Lord, that in your children's dreams there will be encounter today. Father, Lord, throughout the week there will be encounter. Father, Lord, encounter what to do and not what to do. Father, Lord, there will be revelation of where to go and not to go. Throughout this year, Holy Spirit will lead us. You will lead us. We will lead us. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father, we thank you. Blessed be your Holy name. We worship, you, we adore you, Lord, for in Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. Amen. Thank you so much, everybody, for, for um, calling in. You know, for those who are on Facebook, we say thank you for those who call through the Zoom. I pray and I know, as Mr. Yewande said, there shall be a performance Amen. because we dare trust God. Because Amen. we believe God. Amen. So I will see Amen. you tomorrow. That will be the, the third day. Amen. We shall Amen. meet tomorrow at 12 noon American time, 5 p.m. UK time, and 6 p.m. Um, Nigerian time and African time. In Jesus' name. Bless Amen. you. Amen. Thank Amen. you very much. You, God bless you. And Canada, bless you. I think Canada is. Um, uh, 11, will be 10 or 11 uh, for Canada. I can see some people from Canada. God bless you. God bless you, ma'am. God bless you, ma'am. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You. Have a wonderful evening. Amen.